needing a fake boyfriend as she cooked Christmas dinner for her family. Clara called the doctor twice while he was orbiting a planet surrounded by the universe's most dangerous enemies. She convinced him to come but was shocked to find him naked, which he fixed for her by putting a holographic filter on her. Clara introduced him to her family, who saw him naked because he hadn't put the filter on them. Learning from handles that the planet was apparently Gallifrey, Clara and the doctor traveled there. When the papal mainframe arrived, the doctor made Clara swallow a holographic projector to generate holographic clothes around her. Once on board, they met Tasha Lem who agreed to teleport the two to the planet's surface. There, Clara and the doctor were surrounded by weeping angels. The doctor pulled a secret key out of the wig he was wearing and summoned the TARDIS, saving them both. Dressed in proper clothes again, he then flew the TARDIS to the nearby town of Christmas, where they learned that the town was surrounded in a truth field. Searching for the source of the transmission, the two found a crack in time, and the doctor realized that it was the Time Lords trying to return to the universe. The doctor then explained that if he said his real name the Time Lords would return but all hell would then break loose. After learning from Tasha Lem that the planet was Trenzalor, the doctor had Clara return to the TARDIS. In the TARDIS, Clara inserted a device the doctor gave her and was returned home, but grabbed onto the TARDIS as it dematerialized again. Clara returned to Trenzalore 300 years after she left and found the doctor middle-aged. The doctor had been defending Trenzalore from the various threats besieging the planet and revealed to Clara that he had used up all of his regenerations and this would be the end of him. Clara begged him to let someone else take up the job of protecting the planet, but the doctor refused. Clara watched the planet's brief sunrise with him, during which handles ceased functioning and the two were invited by Tasha to return to the papal mainframe. There, Clara and the doctor were led into a trap, as the Daleks had already taken over the mainframe and converted everyone, including Tasha, into Dalek puppets. When the doctor threatened to release the Time Lords if the Daleks tried to kill him, Tasha took Clara hostage, and the doctor claimed not to care if she died. Bravely, Clara declared she would die anyway. Using Clara as an example of bravery, the doctor helped Tasha regain control of herself and she teleported them back to the planet after disposing of the Daleks. The doctor and Clara returned to the TARDIS where they found Clara's turkey cooked, and after promising never to send her away again, he tricked her into returning home once more. As a grief-stricken Clara celebrated Christmas dinner with her family, she had her grandmother repeat the story of how she fell for her grandfather and was relieved to hear the TARDIS returning for her again grabbing a Christmas cracker to take to the doctor. To her surprise, Clara discovered Tasha piloting the TARDIS, and Tasha returned her to Trenzalor some time further into the future after she left, telling her to go find the doctor. Upon reuniting with the doctor, Clara found him very old and weak. While they sat together, Clara opened the cracker and read the poem inside. When the Daleks demanded his surrender, he agreed but asked Clara to remain behind for her own safety. Desperate to change the future, Clara pleaded to the Time Lords for help through the crack. To her surprise, the crack snapped shut disappeared. Clara watched tearfully as the doctor stood on top of Christmas clock tower and surrendered to the Daleks, prepared to die at last. As the Daleks hesitated and the doctor goaded them on, the Time Lords granted the doctor a new regenerative cycle. To Clara's relief, the doctor began to regenerate, using the explosive force of his regeneration energy to destroy the Daleks. When the dust cleared, there was no sign of the doctor, so Clara checked the TARDIS where she found him restored to his youthful self. However, the doctor told her that he would still regenerate. She implored him not to change but despite her pleas, the doctor suddenly regenerated into a new, older incarnation who left Clara confused by staring at her face to face, and then making comments about his new kidneys. The TARDIS suddenly began crashing, and to Clara's horror, the new doctor asked her if she knew how to pilot the TARDIS, having apparently forgotten how to do so himself.